just doesn't seem to be getting any better. SpongeBob, hurry! Squidward's in more trouble than a chili relleno in a pan of grease. We have to help! You're right, Sandy. But if that robot really is like Patrick, he'll eat us for dessert. What should we do? Well, we better figure something out, and pronto. Maybe that button on his back is a self-destruct. I'll try to hit it. Good idea, SpongeBob. But it's time to stop yapping and get to it. Yikes! Looks like SpongeBob's in for a rough ride. do see -si do and around you go. Look at that! The robot's made himself dizzy! The robot better change tactics and fast! do see -si do and around you go! Oh, and the robot is down! And the robot is down! Great Barrier Reef! Oh, and the robot is down! What is Sandy going to do to get SpongeBob unfrozen? Great Barrier Reef! Look at that! The robot's made himself dizzy! That's the ticket! That hot goo could melt anything! Great Barrier Reef! Oh, and the robot is down! Now the robot's taking a beating out there! One more douse with that stuff, and SpongeBob will be back in the ring! Do and around you go. Oh, and the robot is down. SpongeBob is back in the fight! Great Barrier Reef! I see a prime bowling moment right here! That's the ticket! Doe and around you go. I see a prime bowling moment right here. Nice seven ten split by SpongeBob. Doe do and around you go. I see a prime bowling moment right here. Thanks for saving me, guys. I never thought I'd say this, SpongeBob, but I owe you big time. Thanks, Sandy. We'd still be popsicles if it wasn't for her. Aw, shucks. You fellers are gonna make me blush. I think I have fudge in my pants. I'm sorry, Plankton. The Chum Bucket Lab is locked up tight. I don't know if I'll ever get enough golden spatulas to get in. 
Yes, it's the Chum Bucket Security System. I designed it myself. It makes me so proud. It was meant to keep out the hateful throngs of the unwashed. Unfortunately, I never figured I'd be on this side of it. So what are you gonna do, Plankton? We, of course, meaning you, we're gonna have to go out there and get those golden spatulas! Or I'll never get back into the chum bucket and regain control of my robots. What was that? Oh, uh, <clears throat> I said, will I ever get back into the chum bucket to stain all my pots? Yes. Mmm, something's fishy here. Keep looking for golden spatulas, SpongeBob! I'm sure that my robots out there have some. <laughs> hey, you call them your robots. No, I, uh... And I saw a plaque on the butt of one of the robots that said, Property of Plankton. Well, maybe, but I, uh... And I found this order form for robot parts with your signature on it. Can I have that back? I need it for my tax write-off. I think you've been pulling my leg this whole time. Well, duh! I'll bet you made all these robots. And after I get inside the chum bucket and figure out how to stop them, I'm gonna tell everyone. Fine, tell everyone. Be a big tattletale. I'm still smarter than all of you! Maybe this day won't be mine. Or the next. Or possibly even the next. Or 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 the next after that. But the one after the next, after the next, after the next, after that. Well, that one after that, right next to that one, that will be my day. What's wrong, Mr. Krabs? You don't look so good. You gotta help me, boy. The Krusty Krab's been overrun by a bunch of them hoodlum robots of yours. They've booted me out! And worse, they've got all me beautiful shiny objects! Defiling the Krusty Krab? Is there no end to their evil? What are we going to do, Mr. Krabs? We, meaning you, are going to clear the robots out, get me back me restaurant, and most importantly, rescue me money! No more fry cooking for you until the Krusty Krab is robot free. Bubble Buddy, I bet the next move you teach me will be the best one ever. Absolutely, SpongeBob. Super Pinky Shake on it? I would if I had pinkies. Here, I'll blow you some. Yeah, maybe later. Now, pay attention, SpongeBob. This bubble's a doozy! Paying my entire salary and attention. When you're not moving, press this button, and you'll blow a bubble that you can steer as it flies through the air. Wow! Aim carefully, though. You've only got a few seconds of flight time before the bubble pops. I'm a bubble-blowing machine. Time for a little sleepy sneak. Fresh like a spring breeze. Like a new spot. Fresh like a spring breeze. Take that. Nothing like a 
the smell of bubbles in the morning. Smelled like victory. Opening presents. Me worried there for a bit, boy. Worried for me money, of course. <laughs> Here, take this as your reward. <laughs> so, do you want to trade shiny objects for a golden spatula? Alrighty then, come back when you're ready to trade. They serve food here, yes, but they don't serve love. Flash! Authorities have confirmed that the robots running amok through Bikini Bottom are indeed coming from the Chum Bucket. Yes, right where you're standing. Plankton, owner of the Chum Bucket, and best known for the creation of robots whose sole purpose is to cause mayhem and destruction, has denied any involvement. And then stomp on your children! And stop on your children's children! This has been a Bikini Bottom News Flash! Here we are in the Kelp Forest, an interesting area with many sights to see, for those that don't get hopelessly lost first. Has met the Spongeinator.
Robert needs to do laundry. Hi, Mrs. Puff. Driving class isn't out here today, is it? Uh, no, SpongeBob. Why, why do you say that? Do you think we'd have class out here just to hide from you? <laughs> How silly. I'm just, uh, gathering twigs for the winter. Yes, that's it. Oh, can I help? I have a merit badge in twig gathering. Actually, you can help with something else. These robots showed up and scared all the students, I mean, uh, campers, off into the forest. Uh, before the ranger arrives, someone needs to go out and find them. I'll help you find them, Mrs. Puff. I'm the sponge for the job. Thanks, SpongeBob. I'll make sure to give you a nice reward when you've found all of them. Hello again, Mrs. Puff. Good job so far, SpongeBob, but no time to rest now. Let's round these students, uh, campers up before it gets too dark. Okay, Mrs. Puff, I'll keep looking. Patrick, uh, have you seen SpongeBob? If you see him, let him know I'm looking for him. Sure thing, lady. Uh -oh. This one goes boom.
go! like the smell of bubbles in the morning. It smells like victory.
Hi, Mr. Krabs. SpongeBob, help me find Patrick. I have a task that I think he can help me with. Hi, Mr. Krabs. What are you doing here? Ahoy, Patrick! I'm trying to return three stone tiki's to this pedestal so I can get to the kelp cave across that bridge. There could be customers in there! I saw three tiki's scattered around this area, but me old brain couldn't figure out how to get them back up here. Can I try? Sure, why not? I need a good laugh. There's a golden spatula up there for you if you succeed. Oh boy, Mr. Krabs. I'll see what I can do. That's much better.
SpongeBob's underwear fits quite right. Play as a whistle.
Done, son. Next time I need to round up customers for the Krusty Krab, I'll give you a call. Why would the customers want to be made round? <sighs> You're a strange one, you are, Patrick. Well done, son. Why would the. <sighs> Like a new sponge.
Hey, kid, I could really use your help if you had some time to spare. Sure, Barnacle Boy, what do you need? I'm trying to recover my lost energy crystals that power my new secret superhero power. It seems the robots have found my supply and have hidden them in this cave. Secret superhero power? Oh, what's it do, what's it do, what's it do? If I told you, it wouldn't be a secret, would it? Just trust me, it's worth finding these crystals. Uh, I'd go search it myself, but my bunions are acting up today. Well, then you rest those super bones of yours. I'll get searching for these crystals. I don't have all my crystals yet. I hope you're still helping me find them. Yes, I am, Barnacle Boy. I'm doing my best. Okay, good to hear. <laughs> uh, maybe you can get Patrick's help if you're having trouble. Boy? Uh, <laughs> uh, hi. Um, I need, uh, SpongeBob's help if you see him. Okie dokie! for a little sleepy sneak. Yes. 
fresh like a spring breeze. as a rock. Carry a lot of stuff around.
particle boy. I think I found all your crystals. Now I can see your secret superpower. All right, stand back. <laughs> oh boy. <sighs> what happened? I gained the power to trim my nose hairs at super speed. Incredible. Uh -huh, yeah, 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 I guess so. Uh, well then, uh, I need to return to the Mermelair and get back to work. <laughs> but uh, here, take this golden spatula and go away. Of course, Barnacle Boy. I'm always happy to lend my services to my favorite superhero. If you ever run into trouble again, let me know. Yeah, sure, kid. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> and goodbye. Hi again, Barnacle Boy. Uh, hey, kid. Anything I can help you with? No, just saying hi to one half of my favorite superhero duo. Gee, uh, that's great, kid, but uh, don't you have some robot thingy to get back to? Feel like a new sponge. Cha ching! Rama! You've just met the Sponginator.
Hey, it's the pink blobby guy. Mermaid Man, what are you doing here? Oh, hello, Kyle. I was trying to find some of our missing energy crystals when I came across this vine. In my younger days, I held the all-time speed record for vine sliding. You should try it. What a hoot. And if you can beat my best time, I'll give you another of these gold spatulas. Well, I am a bit busy with all these robots, but sure, why not? It does look like fun. Try not to fall off. Beaten my record yet? Perseverance is the key. But you're the greatest superhero that ever lived. How could I, a simple sponge, topple your record? Keep trying, youngster. Keep trying. I love opening presents. It shines. yet. Perseverance is the key. But you're the greatest superhero that ever lived. How could I, a simple sponge, topple your record? Keep trying, youngster. Keep trying.
haven't beaten my... But you're... Keep... Audrey. There's nothing like the smell of bubbles in the morning. Smells like victory. Too pretty. Can't take it. SpongeBob, there you are. Thanks to you, all the campers have safely returned. No problem, Mrs. Puff. Any self-respecting sponge would gladly help. And it was actually fun exploring the kelp forest. You're not so bad when you aren't behind a wheel, SpongeBob. Thanks again. Always glad to lend a hand, Mrs. Puff. I found this golden spatula the other day. Why don't you take it? You've definitely earned it. Wow, Mrs. Puff, I'll cherish it always. You're still here, Mrs. Puff? Oh, SpongeBob, I just feel like I'm all over the place these days. Well, have fun. See you at class. Terror in triplicate! Steve! 